hi guys welcome back to the reactions video tutorial and in this video we are going to learn about the component fill unmount so the question will be gonna what is the component will unmount how we can use that and after that we will make a small example and understand it with the code all right so now first question is what is uh, the component will unmount so this is a lifecycle method and it will be called when a component is unmount uh, then how component will be going to unmount so let's say you have a, a component and when you click on somewhere then this component will be disappear from the dome and that then this function will be called and you have an event you can perform any specific specific operation on this right so now let's understand it with the code so first of all I have a this component which is the uh, default exported component and first of all I'm just going to make one more component so let's say I have a component child you can make the component from in the different file also and in the same file also this is a similar thing right extend react dot component right and now I'm just going to let's copy this code and paste so that we can uh, do it very quickly so I'm just going to write here child component alright so now I'm just going to import this component here right and just remove the extra space so that it will looks nice now you can see that we got the child component here so let's make it small so that it looks nice all right so I'm just going to put a so I'm just going to uh, remove it and show it uh, uh, in this main component on the button click all right so for that I need a state so I'm just going to make a constructor and I need a super function to use the state so I'm just going to write here this dot state and show will be false by default right and with this I'm just going to write here this dot state dot show if this is true then the child function will be show alright otherwise it will be hide fine so by default this will disappear because so this is the false so now I'm just going to make a button here just going to write here toggle child alright so I just got it here and now I'm just going to write here on click function alright on this on click I'm just going to update this state and here just I'm going to write here this dot set state inside the that set state show will be always opposite of the current state so this is the negative acceleration mark this dot state dot show alright so now you can see that whenever I'm just going to click here then you can show that it's an exactly toggle is happening so now how we can just use the component will unmount so I'm just going to write here component will unmount and just going to write here console dot one I'm just going to write here component is hidden now alright so whenever I'm just going to click on first of all it will be shown alright whenever I'm just going to click that means this component is removed from here because the uh, because of this condition alright and when this is shown uh, this is hidden from here the component will be <laughs> unmount and this function will be automatically called let's see how alright whenever it will be hidden then always you get this message and here 
if you want to something like you want to do some color change you want to call an api you want to remove the data anything that you want to do then you can do here all right so let's do some time more it will be called again again and again all right so this is the way that how you can use the component will unmount thanks for watching this video if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe this channel